Are you looking for kitchen cabinet knob ideas? I've got some right here that I ordered because my sister gave me some that she didn't need anymore. And so I started to replace some of the ones in our house, but I ran out and I didn't have enough. I didn't realize how many cabinet knobs I actually had. And I wanted to tell you guys about where I got these because I did not get them on Amazon and they were a, a lot better price than what I was expecting to pay. First of all, hi. Hi to all the new dads out there. This is Dad Reviews. This is where I give you my unedited, hopefully more authentic look at the products that I like, use, and have and buy for our kitchen. So if you're interested in that, you might want to consider clicking that subscribe button. So what we had originally in our kitchen. I'm pretty sure it was original with the house, and our house is a 1980s variety. Were these, uh, I don't know if they're ceramic or what, they're the white knobs and they got this screw that goes uh, through it like this and then you got the nut on the other side that holds it together. And I really didn't like the look of this. We had, we have uh, like a dark wood cabinet uh, uh, coloring. And so I wanted to go with something a little bit more modern, a modern cabinet knob. And so my sister, she just moved into a new house and uh, previously, the previous owners, I guess, changed out a lot of the knobs and she just had this box of them sitting there. So I helped her move and I was like, oh, are you going to do anything with these? And she said, no, you can have them if you want them. So I was like, sweet. So I took those from her and I didn't have enough. So I got online. Actually, no, I went to Lowe's first and I saw they had a bag of 10 for like 20 bucks. And I thought, it's kind of expensive, but let me go ahead and get it just so I can finish out what I needed to do. And then I started counting how many more I needed to do, and I had so many more. So I decided to get on Amazon, and on Amazon, I looked at what they had there, and it was a better price than what they had at Lowe's. I think you got more for about the same amount of money. But then I was like, wait a minute, hang on. I'm sure that there's people who are all the time going and changing out their cabinet knobs and what are they doing with the older ones? Or they have some extra ones and they don't know what to do with them anymore. Let's check eBay. So I got this package on eBay and I think that they're the same, uh, pretty much the same type of knob. Yeah, these are the exact same knob that I wanted. Score. So let me show you guys what we have here. So linked up down in the description below, I'm gonna put a link to some of these on eBay so that you guys can get the best price on. But if y'all wanna see what we ch we're changing our cabinet knobs out to, I'll go ahead and open up one of these for you guys so that y'all can see them. It's just these little stainless steel, I guess stainless steel uh, knobs, uh, very modern looking, kind of that brushed nickel look. And the way these work is you have your screw going through the cabinet and then you just twist these on, which is a lot better than these right here because with these you had to stick your screw through like that and then there's like a little uh, knob on the end. Let me see if I can find one. There's a knob on the end that screws into that. And I think it's just to give it the kind of a, this golden look because it's a, the knob thing was golden. But the problem with this is that whenever, you know, after you've screwed this on and it's tight in there, this piece starts coming loose really, really easily. And like our kids start spinning the knobs and they think it's fun and then the knobs end up falling off. And so I wanted to get away from this style to where the knobs could not spin as much. And uh, I thought that this was a great replacement for it. I have to say that this is actually a little bit different from the ones that they have at Lowe's. And I can tell because of the weight. This is a lot lighter than some of the other ones, but it's okay because I put all those other ones in a, one section of the kitchen and this is gonna go in some other places like the laundry room and whatnot. They have those same style of knobs and I just wanted to update them. But the fact that, you know, they'll be like a tad bit different, but it's nobody's really gonna notice unless you, you guys come over to our house. And, hey, what are those knobs looking like? Those are different right there. <laughs> But like I said, if you guys want to check these things out, I'll link it up down in the description below. Go and see what you can find. There's tons of uh, tons of different styles out there that you can get. But I can definitely recommend looking on eBay because people are buying these things in bulk and then they obviously don't need them all. And so you can uh, you can usually get a good bargain over there. 
If you guys are liking what we're doing here on Dad Reviews and you're looking for some other like home improvement type of videos that I've done, I'll put those right there on the screen. You guys can go and check out some of those videos. Maybe I'll do a quick video about how uh, to install these little guys in our cabinets because that's uh, I need to do that soon to finish that project out. But I'll put some more right there on the screen. You guys can go and click one of those videos. I'll see you on those videos. Thank you dads for watching. That thumbs up is appreciated. If I have any of these left over, I'll make them part of the contest that I do every month on the channel. Uh, um, if you guys want to check that out, I'll link it up down in the description below. I think I'm, I might have a few too many here. So if you guys need a couple of these, uh, I'll put those as a contest prize. Uh, thank you, dads, for watching. That thumbs up is appreciated. And dad out. Oh, do you like our new lighting from the previous video?